All right, this is going to be a very quick video. We're going to show how you can transfer your character in, um, from the old campaign, Wing Commander, to the new Secret Missions one. It's pretty straightforward. If you look at the PDF here, for the, uh, the Secret Missions reference card, as it were, it kind of tells you to use this transfer program. Well, to do that with DOSBox, at least the DOSBox that is packaged up with uh, the, the GOG version of the game, you have to run a couple things. These, these three lines right here are basically what you have to run. So what we'll do is we'll just go into the DOSBox directory, run the DOSBox executable, and we're just going to type these three commands here. I'm not sure about the second command because it's for cloud saves as it you know pretty much clearly states in the name. But you know, just to play it safe, we're going to run that one too. All right, so now that we're in the C directory, as it were, you see the transfer program right there. So we can go ahead and run it. Now there's a quick caveat to this, basically. You can only use this program. Well, here I'll show you. This is one of my saves from Gimli. And it tells you right here, only game saved in the Vega campaign's Venice series may be converted to secret missions. So you can't even do one from, say, Hell's Kitchen, because it won't let you do it, even though that was the last series in the game. So my Vega campaign is up here. I've already converted it. So basically, you just click on the uh, save. Let's see, convert secret one, one of secret missions. Well, I don't want to lose it, because I don't want to have to redo all that stuff. But anyway, you'll notice um, yeah, it's not gonna let me do it. Anyway, you have to click on your your Vega save and then load it that way. And that's how you can get into the secret missions with all your previous um, kills, ranks, medals, all that stuff. Now, one thing it doesn't do is it doesn't. Um, if you lost any wingmen, it just assumes that all the wingmen apparently are alive, which is kind of one of the things that actually says right here. Let's see, where is it? And it tells you right here you got to you have to replace existing wing commander save game. Hmm. It also has a mission selector. That's kind of interesting. That might be worth looking into later, but probably not. Anyway, and, and this is kind of neat. The, the uh, original branching path for Wing Commander is actually right here. Kind of nice to know. Anyway, yeah, that reference card, believe it or not, actually has some pretty decent information. Um, but yeah, that's it for this video. That's all I want to show you all, how to transfer your characters when you're using the uh, GOG.com uh, version of Wing Commander, which to the best of my knowledge, is probably the only version available, really. All right, well, speak to you all later.